We have the van back. The air conditioner went out on the van because the compressor went bad. That's why the AC wouldn't take a charge. And I lost the refrigerator too, which is really my fault. The really big thing though is that the van is fixed and I can get back on the road trip to New Mexico first thing in the morning. Today, whatever this is, I think it's four, on a trip from home to New Mexico, me and Hipsy, the service dog. They fixed the air conditioner. They were able to do it on the same day, which is great because they said that it would probably be this afternoon where they got it finished instead. Nope, they got it done. And now we're getting into Walmart to get some supplies that we lost when I lost the refrigerator in the heat. Okay, let me show you what happened here. The van was in 104 degree heat and I didn't have, of course, air conditioner or anything on. And I forgot that this was in here. Because I was so frustrated when we got in like 1 o'clock in the morning, 2 o'clock, something like that. I've gotten some things out. The sandwich meat, oh my gosh, you could smell it a mile away. But here's what's happened. I can't turn it on. It just will not turn on. Everything's all plugged in. So I'm hoping this is just a temporary thing because I freaking love this fridge, but time will tell. We'll see. I'm going to go ahead and finish cleaning it out. Then off to Walmart. Are you ready to go shopping? Let's go to Walmart. Yay. And this is an oh my gosh, I love you all moment because one of our viewers just sent me 10 bucks earlier today to help replace some of the groceries that I lost. Because what happened was we got in at about 2 o'clock in the morning. I totally, totally forgot with the heat and everything about the food that was in the refrigerator. And I didn't have a whole lot. And then the heat, by the time I remembered it and got down there, the refrigerator had been overcome by the heat, and that's that. got here. It is celery snacks, coconut water. That's good in case you start to get dehydrated. Um, the hard panino snacks is salami wrapped around cheese. I got two of those. I got a Yoplait parfait with fruit because that looked really good. And then I got some Colby and I got some cheese sticks and I got some milk, an apple and a peach and a couple of bananas. Total twenty six seventy one, so that's not too bad. Shout out thanks to Gloria for sending me the ten dollars. It helped. I was so shocked to see it just show up, but I want to say thanks. Now we're getting back on the road. I don't know how far I can drive tonight. I really hope to make New Mexico. All I know is to try and see because I want to see my new grandbaby. How about you, Pipsy? Are you ready to meet her? We've got a surprise stop to make first. I don't believe he knows what to think yet. going into the Air and Space Museum for just a minute. My husband wants a lapel pin or a hat pin, and I told him there wasn't any way I would have time to stop and get that for him. Now we're heading out. He didn't know that I was going to do this because I told him that I wouldn't, that I wasn't going to have time. That way, just in case they hadn't been opened or something, he wouldn't have been disappointed. So... I got his two pins, and he's going to be so tickled. And of course, I had to get something for the baby, so I got her a book. I think that mom and dad are going to be happy because known is my name and spoiling is my game. So I got to do that. This museum, too, it is amazing. We have stopped here before 
and they've expanded it. So I've got to mention it to hubby for when we come back out. And if you guys ever get a chance to come out here, it's so cool. I mean, just like, look at what's behind me here. Neat stuff. Okay, on over to the van. Quick haul to show you what I got at the gift shop. I got a NASA pen. And I got them too. Let's see. Oh, I got a sticker for the van too. And the other pen is the Apollo mission pen. There's actually several Apollo missions. This is the pen kind of commemorating all of them. But it gives me room to grow on so I know what to get them for like Christmas, birthday, etc. And I had to get something for the baby. Good night, astronauts. Is that not cute? For the goodnightbooks.com. So there it is. And, aw, they put in a little bookmark. Reach for the sky. I know she's a little young for the book, but you can't start collecting books too young when it's kids. That's my story anyway. We are back on the road trip to New Mexico. Let's hope tomorrow goes smoothly. Follow me on the journey by subscribing to the channel if you haven't already done so. Don't forget to give me a like on the video and be sure to check things that are popping up on the Instagram right now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Bye.